there. Dobby wants to watch Star Wars. Star Wars will be watched by Dobby. Hi. <laughs> Guys, I'm excited. I'm doing weird shit and I'm getting over cold. Sickness is, is also known as that. And we're just getting over one. So I'm doing and saying some weird shit, but it doesn't fucking matter. And I'm pumped as hell because today I got shit bulging out of my forehead in excitement for Star Wars Revenge of the Sith. That was awesome. I am so excited for this movie. It's been in the works. It's been coming. I've just been so excited for it. This is the movie out of the entire Star Wars series that you guys have been looking forward to the absolute most. Besides the unfortunate Luke Leia reveal, which was extremely traumatic. And if this is the very first time you're clicking on one of my videos and this is the first reaction that you've ever seen on our channel, you've missed quite a bit of the cringy content in terms of Star Wars. So actually you should count your should count your blessings. I'm just, I, there's no, not, there's nothing more that needs to be said except the subtle plug for the Patreon where if you guys want access to these full length movie reactions before they release on YouTube, I will drop the link to the Patreon down below in the top of the description. And let's get watching, shall we? I'm so fucking pumped! A long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. God, I'm amped. This is what drugs must feel like. Okay. You'd be a fucking human now. Episode three, Revenge of the Sith. War! The Republic is crumbling under attacks by the ruthless Sith Lord Count Dooku. There are heroes on both sides, evil is everywhere. Scary. In a stunning move, the fiendish droid leader, General Grievous, has swept into the Republic capital and kidnapped Chancellor Palpatine, leader of the Galactic Senate. The besieged capital, that's one of those words where I was coming up and I thought I was gonna fuck it up, but I didn't and I'm really proud of myself. Besiege Capital, with their valuable hostage, two Jedi Knights lead a desperate mission to rescue the captive Chancellor. Mind you, the entire Clone Wars happened from last movie to this movie, so we just skipped over a bunch of shit, which we will go back and watch again. Let's go, dude. I'm so excited. Stoked you guys are here with me, by the way. Oh, real quick, if you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button and I'll never say that again in my life. Bye-bye. Big ass spacecraft. Oh, shit. R2, baby! General Grievous' ship is directly ahead. Oh, I see it. Oh, this is going to be easy. Our boys! <laughs> Damn, Anakin's gotten edgy. Set his foils in the tech position. This is where the fun begins. Uh, oh. Missiles, they overshot us. They're coming around. All right, R4. No, 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 no. R4! Stand by, reverse thrusters. We got him, R2. Anakin's got like an evil laugh going on, right? He reminds me of in Stranger Things, Billy, the older brother, the fucking edgy, badass, traditionally hot dude with his fucking mullet and his muscles bulging. He's like, yeah! Sup, bitches? What? But Anakin's got like a nicer vibe about him, but still that edginess. R4, be careful, you have a- <laughs> Oh dear. Oh shit, they just ripped our R4's head off. They're all over me. Anakin! Anakin, they're all on my cockpit! <laughs> Fuck these little mosquito robot bullshitters, dude. You're gonna let these guys take you out? Get him, R2. R2, oh, fuck this little vermin up. Oh. The general's command ship is dead ahead. <laughs> well, have you noticed the shields are still up? Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> what the fuck? That was dope! I'm drooling. I'm drooling. <laughs> 
Dude, that was so cool. Holy shit. The whole fight scene going through the going through space? That was fucking dope. Who's this fucking cyborg with the smoker's cough? Okay, is any of that- Who would actually drop their weapons? Who the hell is intimidated by creatures that say, Drop your weapons. Drop them. Did you press the stop button? No, did you? No. R2, activate elevator. Three, one, 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 step, step, four. Aw, he's blending Coming in with the other R2 unit looking uh, things. Always on the move. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> My boy slid in. That's how R2 been sliding in the DMs. Hands up, Jedi. Stupid little astro droid. Hey, he is not stupid. They're stupid. They just got their faces cut off by an elevator. <laughs> Damn, R2! Chancellor, are you all right? Can't do cool. All right, here's this weasel-faced man. <laughs> you didn't just want to take the stairs, dude? I've been looking forward to this. My powers have doubled since the last time we met, Count. Good. Twice the pride, double the fall. I can smell your breath. Your teeth look rotten, dude. Floss. <laughs> the hell was that? Yeah. <laughs> You have anger, but you don't use them. Yeah, and I smell dog shit and pork rinds, dude. Brush your mouth. Oh shit. Good, Anakin, good. Kill him. Kill him now. Holy shit. He's at a crossroads now, you're gonna do the good or the bad thing. I shouldn't. He knows what he should and shouldn't do. Do it. Shut up, weasel. Okay. Okay. He knew he sh did well. And he Don't reinforce his dark behavior, he bastard! Did. We know where that's gonna take him! I shouldn't have done that. It's not the Jedi way. He cut off your arm, and you wanted revenge. God, it's like when you're watching a younger person, like your kid, for example. I don't have kids, so I don't know for real. But when you're watching your kid go down the wrong path and there's nothing you can fucking do to help them. All batteries, fire! Fire! Dude, this is... These scenes are so fucking cool. The later movie fight scenes? Insane. Reverse stabilizers. Reversing stabilizers. Shut up. Uh, R2, you okay? I missed something. What is that? Uh, R2, shut down the elevator. <laughs> Too late, jump! Oh, that was so clutch. General, I found the Jedi. They're in hallway 328. Why is some robot bastard coughing so much? Doesn't coughing mean you got an irritant in your lungs? Does he have lungs? Am I a dumbass? R2 will be along in a few moments and then... is <laughs> 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 screaming down the halls. Hey! Do you have a plan B? Ah, yes. The negotiator. Excuse me. <laughs> Ah, the droid has manners, dude. Anakin Skywalker, I was expecting someone with your reputation to be a little older. And I was expecting you not General to wheeze Grievous. like you smoke a pack of Newports a day. He's shorter than I expected. Oh, General Grievous. Jedi scum, your lightsabers will make a fine addition to my collection. <laughs> Crush them, make them suffer. <laughs> <laughs> it's just cool, it's like back to back to back badass fight scenes. There's never any music playing for the fight scenes though. I wonder if that would enhance it. Like Aaron, fix this. Add some music to the fight scene. Yeah, that's better. Oh shit. 
Whoa. What is Grievous's purple weapon called? Should I know that? <laughs> Drop yourself in. We lost something. Not to worry, we are still flying half a ship. <laughs> okay, I guess that's definitely a glass half full type of guy. Or ship half here type of guy. It's like R2 chill, dude. That wild ass scream, we've never heard that before. At least I haven't. Solid. Another happy landing. <laughs> dude, how long in this movie have we seen? The first 25 minutes of the movie, it's been insane. I think the first 25, 30 minutes of this movie has been my favorite part of the entire, the entire prequel set, you know? <gasps> oh my God, I see Goldman. Someone needs to be the poster boy. Hold on, this whole operation was your idea. You rescued me from the bus droids, and you killed Count Dooku, and you rescued the Chancellor, carrying me unconscious on your back. <laughs> All because of your training. Damn, Anakin's humble now. But you owe me one, and not for saving your skin for the tenth time. Ninth time. That business on Cato Nemoidia doesn't, doesn't count. <laughs> General Grievous will run and hide as he always does. He's a coward. But yeah, he's a pussy with a smoker's cough. Come along, you two. Republican you Goldman, Thank baby! You. I really and truly think that Goldman might be my favorite character in all of Star Wars. I'm sorry. Excuse me, sir. What's up, Padme? You want to make some whoopee? Wait, not here. Yes, here. I'm tired of all this deception. I don't care if they know we're married. With the eerie, dark music going on in the back? Are you all right? What's going on? She's thrown off by your weird vibes, dude. Something wonderful has happened. God, how does she make that cinnamon? I'm pregnant. <gasps> what? I mean, we knew he was gonna have a son, but goddamn, I didn't know it was gonna be that soon. Y'all been getting busy. Well, that's one. That's wonderful. How does she make that cinnamon roll ass hair look hot? We're not gonna worry about anything right now. Yeah. And honestly, what are your options in space? I mean, they got, they got Plan B up there. Like, it, you probably only got one option, right? Why am I wearing pants for this? Uh. This is the second most fun thing you can do, pantless. First thing being watching all of the Star Wars movies in one sitting. Uh. Okay, I'm s He's supposed to be the leader of the army. I'm sorry, you don't look like a badass when you're running around like this. You look like a fucking dumbass. The end of the war is near. Oh. But the loss of Count Dooku. Soon I will have a new apprentice. One far younger and more powerful. He's talking about Anakin. And I still want to know about Hologram Man just a little bit more. How he got to be in that position. Huh. Anna, I want to have our baby back home on Naboo. You want to show me your boobs? No, I didn't say that! <laughs> You're so beautiful. Annie, keep it in your pants. She's already pregnant, dude. Damn, my man waking up moist. What's bothering you? He sees that you're gonna go through hell. Nothing. I remember when I gave this to you. How long is it gonna take for us to be honest with each other? Just tell her. It was a dream, like the ones I used to have about my mother. Just before she died. It was about you. Wait. Tell me. Padme's not gonna die, is she? It was only a dream. I thought it was just a foreshadowing of her giving birth. You die in childbirth. It was only a dream. I won't let this one become real. Do you have the power to do that? It's wild. I'm trying to like look for context clues as to when the darkness sneaks in to Anakin based on the music and everything. But it's like, Iggy's so hot and cold. He says one thing that's like super vindictive and fucked up. Like, no, nah, I'm gonna kiss you now. You're my woman. And then says something very sweet, very light and dark. It's, it's per perfectly symbolized by that, sh that shadow right there. Half of his face is light. The other half is dark. Perfect representation right there. The fear of loss is a path to the dark side. Oh. Attachment leads to jealousy. Oh, wow. Train yourself to let go of everything 
you fear to lose. I'm probably looking too far into this, but it looks like the majority of Yoda's face is light with only a little bit of shadow. And the majority of Anakin's face is shadow with just a little bit of light. And it seems like Yoda's more of the, the good side, the light side, and Anakin's leaning more towards the dark. Cause we, I mean, we know the writing on the wall, we see it. Be careful of your friend, Palpatine. Be careful of what? He's a fucking scoundrel, dude. He told you to behead a guy, and you knew it was wrong. I hope you trust me, Anakin. I don't trust any man that looks like a badger. Anakin, I'm appointing you to be my personal representative on the Jedi Council. But the Council elects its own members. They'll never accept this. I think they will. They need you more than you know. That's not good. The devil comes for you when you're in high and mighty places. You're on this council. But we do not grant you the rank of master. What? Uh-oh. He's pissed. This is outrageous. It's unfair. How can you be on the council and not be a master? Take a seat, young Skywalker. He's whipping out his dark side a little bit. You mean to tell me this phallic-faced man is a master and Anakin isn't? Go, I will. Good relations with the Wookiees I have. What kind of nonsense is this? Put me on the council and not make me a master? The fact of the matter is you are too close to the Chancellor. The council doesn't like it when he interferes in Jedi affairs. There's nothing to do with this. The only reason the council has approved oh, your appointment is because the Chancellor trusts you. The council wants you to report on all the Chancellor's dealings. They want you to be a rat. Bring the rat tail back! Put it back on him! You're asking me to do something against the Jedi Code against a mentor and a friend. That's what's out of place here. Yeah, and the person asking you is a stronger friend and a stronger mentor, you jackass. Anakin did not take to his new assignment with much enthusiasm. I don't trust him. With all due respect, Master, is he not the chosen one? Is he not to destroy the Sith and bring balance to the Force? So the prophecy says. That Miss Reg could have been. He will not let me down. <laughs> Which means he's gonna let you down. And he always will from here on out. What if the democracy we thought we were serving no longer exists, and the Republic has become the very evil we've been fighting to destroy? I don't believe that. <laughs> You're sounding like a separatist. Hey! That's your wife! What is it? Nothing. Don't do this. Don't shut me out. Let me help you. God, it's just a slow decline to the dark side. It's so frustrating. Anakin, you've got fucking everything here, dude. You're married to Norm Natalie Portman. She's carrying your baby. You're on the fucking council. The youngest one who ever did it. Be appreciative for what you have. Makes me feel like my parents whenever I was younger. You will finish your tater tots. There are starving kids in Africa that would love those tater tots. I was always like, well, send them to them. Anakin, come closer. I have good news. Our clone intelligence units have discovered the location of General Grievous. I would worry about the collective wisdom of a council if he didn't select you for this assignment. <sighs> He's brainwashing you, Anakin! Sit down. Leave us. Oh, you just dismissed the rest of the party? This is giving me like Abraham Lincoln theater assassination vibes. If that's not in the story, they should have put that in. Assassinate this dude. The Jedi Council want control of the Republic. They're planning to betray me. Wow. Both sides are telling him the same exact advice, and it just depends on where that feeling stems from on his inside. It just depends on how he is on the inside, dude. Fuck. They asked you to spy on me, didn't they? Yeah? Wait, no? The Sith rely on their passion for their strength. They think inwards only about themselves. And the Jedi don't. Notice Anakin's face right now. Most of it is light with just a little shadow. I, I wonder if that's on purpose to showcase like the level of dark versus light in him. Over here, the tragedy of Darth Plagueis the Wise. What are y'all, what is this? What are y'all watching? Is these space sperms? Darth Plagueis was a dark lord of the Sith he could use the force to influence the midi-chlorians to create life. He could even keep the ones he cared about from dying. Oh, God. He could actually <sighs> save people from death. The dark side of the force is a pathway to many abilities some consider to be unnatural. 
Well, that's a fucking wrap. Anakin's gonna go down the damn dark pathway so that he can save Padme. He taught his apprentice everything he knew. Then his apprentice killed him in his sleep. Ironic. He could save others from death, but not himself. Is it possible to learn this power? <sighs> not from a Jedi. <laughs> but from a Sith. You want my weasel self to teach you how to save your fucking wife, laddie? I don't know why he all of a sudden became Irish. <sighs> Frustration has set in internally for me. The Chancellor has requested that I lead the campaign. Master Kenobi should go. I agree. Aye. Aye. <sighs> <laughs> Anakin's gonna get butthurt about that, isn't he? Oh, God. Oh, shit! Wookie army! You know that army stinks like shit. Looks like a damn head and shoulders commercial. <laughs> what in the damn George of the Jungle is that, dude? Master, I haven't been very appreciative of your training, and I apologize. You are strong and wise, Anakin, and I am very proud of you. It will not be long before the Council makes you a Jedi Master. They have such a wholesome connection. It makes me really happy, but extremely scared for what's gonna happen. That evil look right there, dude. It creeps out more than I want it to. <sighs> Whoa, that's sick. Don't give up, Padme. Anakin, this is the dark side creeping in, dude. But he's even wearing all black. Well, damn, so is she. He says you've been under a lot of stress. And I'm here to relieve that stress. Hop on the bed, Popper, spread them legs, whip your saber at. What? I'm not the Jedi I should be. I want more. Ah. Uh, and I know I shouldn't. Be thankful for what you have, asshole. I start to get pissed at him. I love Anakin and I despise him at the same time. I won't lose you, Padme. I promise you. No, I promise you. <sighs> First of all, she can't make that promise. She didn't fucking know. Second of all, he can't make that promise without telling her the full extent of it. Greetings, young <laughs> Jedi. Ew, what the hell kind of man are you? With your kind permission, I should like some fuel. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, oh, oh, yeah. We are being held hostage. They are watching us. I understand. Thousands of I would rather not look at those teeth like Tell that. He Seems like a nice fella, but his dental hygiene's outrageous. Tell Cody I've made contact. Cody? Okay. <laughs> My god, look at that griffin lizard, dude. I am sending you to the Mustafar system. Okay, Newport, I don't give a fuck about your plan, really. I have doubts about your ability to Dude, we about to swoop in on Smokerman? Hello there. <laughs> Dude, I've seen that meme everywhere, bro. Hello there. You are a bold one. That's so satisfying that I know the origin of it now. Back away. I will deal with this Jedi slime myself. I've been trained in your Jedi arts by Count Dooku. Why are y'all telling each other about your skill set? Just fucking fight! Who gives a shit? My god, the dude's got four sabers. Oh shit, he's just hornetting him around, dude. Okay, that's terrifying. Just take your saber and throw it down the center at his face. Actually, that's probably why I would be a terrible Jedi, because then I would have no lightsaber and he would have five. Ha! <laughs> Only three left, bitch. Oh, two left! <laughs> I mean, I know this guy's bad, but he doesn't seem that bad to me. I feel like I'd actually kind of like him if I got to know him, knew his interests and what he liked to do on the weekends and stuff, you know? You are All right, bring in Anakin. Oh, I don't think so. <laughs> oh. Ew. I just hate things that crawl like that. I'm convinced that's the reason I hate roaches, because they crawl in a disgusting-ass way. 
Let's go! I love his fucking little jungle pet. It's like a mix between a lizard and a peacock. Ride that lizard cock! <laughs> Never, I'm gonna stop saying things now. I sense a plot to destroy the Jedi. He does not give up his emergency powers after the destruction of Grievous, then he should be removed from office. Uh, yeah, listen to Phallic Face. Great care we must take. We've just received a report from Master Kenobi. He has engaged General Grievous. I should be there with him. Yeah. Don't you wonder why they won't make you a Jedi Master? Stop brainwashing him, Squirrel! Let me help you to know the subtleties of the Force. Even the nature of the dark side. You know the dark side? One must study all its aspects, not just the dogmatic narrative. You guys are good. I mean, the dark side folks, like, yeah, don't you just want to know about it? Pretty cool stuff. All the cool kids are learning about the force, dark side that is. <laughs> and you will be able to save your wife. There it is. From certain death. There it is. Don't smile like that, wombat. You're the Sith Lord. Don't continue to be a pawn of the Jedi Council. This is the Sith Lord, the revenge of the Sith, and his way to get revenge on everybody else is to turn Anakin to the dark side and make him be Darth fucking Vader. Is that it? Behead this guy. I can feel your anger. Wait, wait, no, don't behead him, because that's what the dark side would do. Don't kill him. Give him a back massage and a lobster. Know the power of the dark side. Power to save. I mean, he's good. Tempting as hell, right? That's how the devil gets to you in real life. It's a it's a creep. It's very attractive. It seems like the easy thing to do. And there's a lot of religious undertones in Star Wars, in my opinion. The dark side is the devil. And the devil and the dark side work the same way. Oh, damn. Yes! All right, Kenobi, fucking just wreck this little Newport pack. Tired of him. <gasps> Wait, he actually had organs? Oh my god, he just shot his heart. It's so funny to me because in a lot of like the fight scenes so trying to fight with these like crazy evil villains, it's always this whole big ordeal and then it ends in such a quick little beep beep, peer peer. It just makes me feel like it could have ended a long time ago and it didn't. I don't know. I think Chancellor Palpatine is a Sith Lord. A Sith Lord? The one we've been looking for. Are you sure? Absolutely. We must move quickly if the Jedi Order is to- Cause how about you guys make Anakin a master and maybe he would have enough confidence in the, in the council to be on your side for the rest of time. Own good, stay out of this affair. <sighs> if what you've told me is true, you will have gained my trust. But for now, remain here. <sighs> oh, it's so close. Yes. It's so close to Anakin being on their, on their side, I think. Just give Anakin a little bit more power or freedom to do things. But at the same time, I understand because you don't want to cater to some snot-nosed little kid. Not that he is that, but uh, complicated issue. Aw, Anakin. He doesn't want Padme to die. Goldman? That's so wholesome. I love Goldman. Oh, shit. Master Windu. In the name of the Galactic Senate of the Republic, you're under arrest, Chancellor. The Senate will decide your fate. I am the Senate. You are a fuck up. It's treason, then. Oh, God. That's the same energy in like devil movies where people get possessed. Sith dude seems possessed. Just headbutt this old timer, dude. You're Sam Jack. Oh shit! He even has mannerisms and sounds like a fucking weasel, dude. End him! Oh fuck, Anakin's gonna save him. Uh, don't tell me he killed Sam Jack. I was right. 
A Jedi are taking over! You have lost. No, no, you are dying! Oh, shit! You know what those powers remind me of? Stormfront from the boys. You know what she is? A Nazi. You know what this old timer fuck is now to me? A Nazi! Oh, let him kill me! Anakin, come on. That's because you got weak kegels. Ew. I am going to end this once and for all. He must stand trial. He's too dangerous to be left alive. It's not the Jedi way. He must live. Wh Please don't. I need him. Please don't. No. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh my god! Ew! What a demonic looking man! Ah! Ew, it sounded like you just climaxed. What have I done? Oh god, that's so complicated. Become my apprentice. No! I mean, we know he's going to, but. Whatever you <gasps> ask. Why are you being such a weak bitch? Just help me save Padme's life. I pledge myself. Oh my god. To your teachings. Oh my god. It's such a pendulum with Anakin this movie, dude. He literally said 14 seconds ago, what have I done, knowing he did something wrong, and then deliberately chose to just obey this fucking charcoaled ass Nazi oh, man. You? It looks like you're straining to poop, dude. Henceforth, you shall be known as Darth Vader. Fuck. Dude, that gave me chills. I know this is wrong, but that's super badass, okay? Let's just take a second to know how badass that is, but at the same time, how fucked up it is. When the Jedi learn what has transpired here, they will kill us. I agree. The Council's next move will be <gasps> against the Senate. Yeah. This, oh my god! Oh my god, how did I not put it together? The charcoal-faced man, that was the inception. That's why he looks like that. The Roomba is trying to fuck up my movie. I want you to go to the Jedi Temple. Do what must be done, Lord Vader. Do not hesitate. Show no mercy. What is this, Cobra Kai? Show no mercy. After you have killed all the Jedi in the temple, go to the Mustafa system. Wipe out Viceroy. Gunray and the other separatist leaders. He's gotta murder everybody. This man looks like the Disney witch in Snow White. He also looks like a serpent. He's the devil. Murder everybody and then we'll have peace. Nice. You guys ever had everything bagel cashews? They're delicious. So, my question is, what happens if Padme would have been fine? Did the dark side put those thoughts in Anakin's head to make him be more magnetic towards the dark side? Probably would have been fine. Commander Kirby. The time has come. Execute Order 66. The what the hell is Order 66, dude? <laughs> Oh, no, not the lizard dick! Oh. Oh, wait, what did we call him earlier? Lizard cock? Whatever. Oh, dude, this is sad. I don't want to watch this. He knows, he feels it. I think at some point, the aesthetics of an individual has to come into play. Do you want to be taking orders from a man that looks like a roasted ball sack? And that's not even, like, that's pretty accurate in terms of the description of the man. Wow, that's crazy. A ain't nobody killing Yoda. Boy just beheaded both of them motherfuckers. Let's go, Yoda.
Oh, he just climbs on his back. That's so cute. Master Skywalker, there are too many of them. What are we going to do? Oh my god, he's gonna kill the kids. Oh my god, he's gonna kill the kids. They're so cute. Why the fuck would you kill the kids? That, that doesn't even make any sense. At least take them and train them to learn the dark side. Use them as little minions. That's, that was a boneheaded maneuver. Gosh, I feel it in my heart. I feel like I did something wrong just for watching Anakin do his fuck ass thing. What the hell? I feel like I should have known who that little kid was. Aww. So much death of the innocent. Goodbye, Tarfur. Goodbye. Chewbacca, miss you. I will. Aww. Chewie. <laughs> that is so sad. Hopefully we'll be able to intercept a few Jedi before they walk into this catastrophe. Did you find Kenobi? Sir, no one could have survived that fall. No one could have survived the fall, but he did. Again, I'm just spitting everywhere, dude. I don't know why my mouth is pr producing so much saliva watching this movie. <laughs> Senator Organa. My clone troops turned on me. I need help. We have just rescued Master Yoda. It appears this ambush has happened everywhere. Yeah, attack 66 or whatever the hell it was. I heard there was an attack on the Jedi Temple. You can see the smoke from Yeah, here. it was him. He's a fucking scumbag. Leave him, Padme. The Jedi have tried to overthrow the Republic. I can't believe that. Oh, Anakin, what are you going to do? Well, how about you ask what he did, and the answer to that would be kill numerous people, including a bunch of little kids. What about Obi-Wan? We can only hope that he's remained loyal to the Chancellor. Yeah, my ass. And again, I'm afraid. You should be. Everything will soon be set right. The separatists have gathered on the Mustafar system. I'm going there to end this war. <sighs> Padme deserves somebody better than you, Anakin. God damn it. So frustrating. It's like if Michael Jordan was about to get signed in the Bulls and he just starts, he just picks up a damn crack pipe and goes to Skid Row instead. That's what it makes me think of. Anything I might do? No, thank you, 3 PM. I feel so helpless. Aw, Goldman. That's sad. Don't feel helpless. <sighs> There's going to be an Anakin and Obi-Wan fight, isn't there? I mean, I know that also comes later on, but... Heard from no one, have we? Received a coded retreat message we have. It requests all Jedi to return to the temple. If there are any stragglers, they will fall into the trap and be killed. <sighs> yeah, depictions of hell. No, the Sith are demons. Quick lesson in life for everybody watching. If you're still watching at this point in the video, and if you are, I fucking love you. And if you're not subscribed, slap your asshole and then say hit the subscribe button. But in life, if things seem too good to be true, they probably are. Someone says I can save your wife, they probably can't. Uh, it's crazy to think that at one point R2 was helping supplement the dark side just for a little bit. That's accurate, right? Welcome, Lord Vader. We've been expecting you. <laughs> With the music in the background, it's badass, it is! But it's so frustrating. I love watching Yoda fuck people up. An amazing Jedi will be hunted down and defeated. <sighs> Doesn't sound like a good plan to me. My god, look at all that death. <gasps> oh, the... Not even the younglings survived. Killed not by clones. By a lightsaber he was. Who could have done this? You know. The attempt on my life has left me scarred. But I assure you, my resolve has never been stronger. And your skin has never smelled dis more disgusting. Oh shit! Dude, that's a crazy- I'm making that the thumbnail. That's a crazy- I I'm sure everybody has, but that's a crazy shot. The Republic will be reorganized into the first galactic empire! Okay, put your hands down, you're not Jesus. So this is how liberty dies. Yeah. With thunderous applause. Yeah, thanks to your fucking dumbass husband. Lord Sibius promised us peace. Only one. Yeah, well, I promised him to put you in pieces! So take that! Idiots. Wait, Master. There is something I must know. 
can't be. It is. It can't be. It is! I can't watch anymore. <sighs> Destroy the Sith. We must. I will not kill Anakin. Do it. Do it. The boy you trained, gone he is, consumed by Darth Vader. Darth Vader sounds way lamer than Anakin Skywalker. Anakin Skywalker's a badass name. Did any Star Wars fanatics name their children Anakin? Cause that's a, that's a kick-ass name. I'm not gonna lie. Anakin has turned to the dark side. You're wrong. How could you even say that? I have seen a, a security hologram of him killing younglings. Not Anakin. He could. He did. He might as well pierce your stomach with a lightsaber, kill his own kid. It's a bit dark, but I don't know. He's a dark one now. I don't believe you. It's ironic because Anakin didn't want to lose Padme to death, but he's going to lose her in a worse way to life, meaning she's still going to be alive, but he's not going to have her. It's even worse, kind of. You're going to kill him, aren't you? Not this movie. And no. <laughs> Anakin is the father, isn't he? I'm so sorry. <sighs> What, she's starting to show, or you just gotta, you gotta use the force to tell? God, you fucked up, individual. You know what's been really impressive throughout this movie, though, is, like, Anakin's internal dilemma with the light and the dark. And how apparent it's been to the viewers, to us watching the show, we've seen him struggle with it, and I think that they did a great job bringing that to light. No pun intended. Bringing that to dark. <laughs> Star Wars jokes. I can make them now. But seriously, that's an aspect of this movie that is really well done. Just his ability to just be on the fence and teeter-totter back and forth and keeping us on edge throughout the whole movie. And we hope that he's not going to do what we know he's going to do, but it's just a fascinating way to make a movie, and they did a really good job with it. You have restored peace and justice to the galaxy. My ass. Yeah, peace and justice, you just murdered children. I'm gonna say that again, Anakin. You murdered children. It hurts me to see her hurting. God, she's got some plump lips. I saw your ship. Obi-Wan told me terrible things. He said you've turned to the dark side, that you killed younglings. Well, those are all true. I am becoming more powerful than any Jedi has ever dreamed of, and I'm doing it for you. She didn't want a child murderer going around doing dark shit, dude! I have brought peace to the Republic. Peace. I am more powerful than the Chancellor. I can overthrow him. She didn't know you anymore. I don't believe what I'm hearing. Padme, run the hell away. Obi-Wan was right. You've changed. Yeah, he sucks now. The Jedi turned against me. Don't you turn against me. I don't know you anymore. Told you. My heart. Oh. You're going down a path I can't follow. Because of Obi Wan. No, because of you. Take accountability, Jack. Fuck. Stop now. Come back. I love you. Liar! You brought him here to kill me. No. Let her go, Anakin. Anakin, what the fuck? Let You're the one that go. killed her. <gasps> no. You turned her against me! You dumbass bastard, you did that yourself. You have done that yourself. Uh, I should write the I should write the script for this movie. You will not take her from me! You're taking her from yourself! You have become the very thing you swore to destroy. I have brought peace. Yeah. Freedom. You know who also Justice says stuff like that? Security. Hitler. Oh, this is what I brought peace! Well, shut up! If you're not with me, then you're my enemy. <sighs> Only a Sith deals in absolutes. I will do what I must. You will try. Oh, God. <sighs> Move! <laughs> Aaron, we gotta bleep that out. I'm sorry. Did the dark side take over me, too? I think it's just because I watched the boys recently. You survived. Surprised? Hey! These fight scenes are really cool and fun to watch though, aren't they? Sick. I have waited a long time for this. Well, you're gonna wait a little longer, Disney witch looking ass. Ew. The Jedi are no more. Not if anything to say about it. I have. 
<laughs> yeah, let's laugh at you, you dumbass. If so powerful you are, why leave? Your Vita will become more powerful than either of us. That doesn't sound like too manly and powerful of you. Uh, I may not be able to beat you, but the young kid coming up under me could probably maybe do that. Shut up. Oh, you look like an evil rat. Oh, God. <laughs> Stomp him! I, dude, these lightsaber fights are sick! Whoa! Guys, can you shed some light on this for me? I don't know if like, I saw Anakin holding his lightsaber with one hand against Obi-Wan with two. Does the strength of the force used matter or the physical strength of the person with one arm versus two arms and their ability to withstand it? I don't know. Just kick him in the face? A disgusting individual to look at. Him with his constant cackling. So far, the only difference between the dark side and the Jedi's in terms of power has been this electric thing from their fingertips. Let's go, Yoda! And Yoda is the strongest Jedi master, yeah? Oh God, that makes gives me goosebumps. It makes me sweat. Makes my ew. What the hell was the point of that flying ass drone? Just comes to spectate. Oh, Captain Kagi to prepare my shuttle for immediate takeoff. Basically, you're retreating and you're a pussy. Yeah, good things don't happen on bridges in this series. Wow, look at that though, the CGI is so cool! Super well done! Oh, damn. Just Mega Jump up! Oh, God. Into exile, I must go. Failed, I have. Aww. Don't seem like you failed in my heart, Yoda. You, Anakin. I should have known the Jedi were plotting to take over. Anakin, Chancellor Palpatine is evil. From my point of view, the Jedi are evil. Well, then you are lost. Yeah, I mean, seriously, dude. How the fuck did you get so far gone? You look like you're in a punk band now. This is the end for you, my master. It's over, Anakin. I have the high ground. You underestimate my power. Don't try it. You're a cocky little shit, Anakin. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, good. I, I feel zero sympathy for you. Zero sympathy, zero empathy. None. You were the chosen one. It was said that you would destroy this sin, not join them. What a disappointment. God, that's the biggest letdown I've ever seen in cinema history. Demons! The devil! The dark side! You were my brother, Anakin! Obi-Wan! I loved you! Oh. <sighs> oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. We always talk about fire being a symbol of purity and rebirth, but in this instance, it's rebirth, but for a fucked up purpose, and it's certainly not purity. Goldman! Oh, oh, good, she's alive. Is Anakin alright? Nah, he's, he's a fuck up, and both of his legs are chopped off, and he's sizzled to a crisp. She deserves so much better. I know this idealistic perspective, some utopian bullshit, but couldn't they have just been happy? Did he ever have to be Darth Vader? Like, so disappointing. But such a good fucking story, am I right? Okay, so that's how he becomes mostly machine. Consumed by the darkness. <sighs> Ew, I would rather not look at that. 
Anakin, can you do some self-reflection and see after you join forces with testicle skin face over here? Do things look better in your life? You've lost Padme, you've lost your legs, you've lost your skin, you've lost your mentor, you've lost the galaxy, you've lost all the Jedis, you've lost all the children that you fucking savagely murdered. That seemed good to you? Excuse me, Master Yoda. What do you want, Miguel Prado? If you get that joke, I love you. I hate the way he walks. Cause his hands out like a prissy little bitch. For reasons we can't explain, we are losing her. What, from a broken heart? She's dying. She has lost the will to live. We need to operate quickly if we are to save the babies. Babies? Oh, oh yeah, Luke and Leia. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was old news, we knew that. That's right. Why did I not think about Leia? Ew. <laughs> wow, this is what he foresaw. Is it her or Ido? Luke. Uba. 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 Is it her or Ida? It's a girl. You guys know if Luke and Leia ever grow up and you know like... <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, sorry, Aaron. Uh, it's funny. Wow. Wow. I think Anakin killed her! This is the look of defeat. Right here. Thanks, Anakin. He does look like a badass. Can you hear me? Yeah, he can, Squirrel. Fuck off. One of you sounds like a 70-year-old smoker. The other sounds like he's got sleep apnea. Where is Padme? Is she safe? No, she's dead. It seems in your anger, you... So you did all of that for nothing. You did all of that destruction for nothing. You joined the dark side for fuck nothing. Don't smile. That is so sad. Oh my god. Hidden. Safe. The children must be kept. Before I started watching this movie, my cousins told me I was about to watch a top three movie of all time. In all, in the history of all movies. You agree with that? And what of the boy? To Tatooine. Do his family send him? Oh, wow. I will take the child and watch over him. Wow, it's crazy to see that. Why did they split him up? Because Miguel Prado's ass always dreamed of having a daughter? Who gives a fuck? Can't separate the kids. An old friend has learned the path to immortality. Your old master. <gasps> Qui-Gon. Qui-Gon. Qui-Gon! How to commune with him, I will teach you. I'm placing these droids in your care. Treat them well. Qui-Gon! Have the protocol droids mind wiped. What? Wait. <gasps> have their minds wiped! Oh no. Nah, wait. They don't get wiped. That's why they're se severely ahead of every other R2 unit and Goldman unit, for lack of knowing what the fuck's going on there. Aw, <sighs> Jar Jar, I haven't heard you say one annoying ass thing this movie. I love Jar Jar. <gasps> oh my god. She still had it. Wow. This makes me want to rewatch them all in chronological order now. Maybe we'll do that a year after the last Star Wars, but we still got Clone Wars and a million other fucking movies to make it through. I hate that I can see this dude's nose peeking out of his fucking hood and his lips and his chin. Makes me want to punch him right in that fucking sniffer, dude. It's a good thing that the actual order of the movies wasn't the chronological order, because that totally would have ruined the Luke and Leia dynamic. I like thinking that they were lovers. Wow. And here we are at the beginning. What a cool fucking way to make some movies, dude. Now I feel like I need to go back and see what happens at the end of, at four, five, and six. I'm like, what happened to Luke? Ah, oh, duh, I am still so sad that was fucked up. Oh.
That was by far my favorite Star Wars movie that we've seen thus far. I think it was so well done. It was so treacherous and it hurt me to my core, but in terms of a movie, it was incredible. I mean, this movie was so cool because it wrapped up everything that we've seen up to this point, but at the same time is the start of where we started at the beginning of the journey. It was it was just, it's incredibly full circle, but half of a circle, but the full circle, if that makes sense. The movie was just so entertaining. Like the CGI was out of this world. It was just very well done. The fight scenes were fucking dope. So from the very beginning scene of this movie to like all the fight, the fight sequences and the space chase and all that crazy shit going on. It was just, it, it never took its foot off the gas. The entire movie was just so entertaining. Had you on edge, it was angsty. We got to follow Anakin from a cute, tiny little kid to an angsty teenager to a sex crazed young adolescent to a fucking Jedi master just about, and then his transition to the dark side. Anakin and Padme's relationship, their babies being birthed into the world and divvied up, Padme dying. The last conversation we had between Anakin and Obi-Wan before Anakin became the fuck ass that he was. <sighs> My favorite movie, hands down. And I wanna say thank you guys so much for checking it out with me. And with all that being said, if you are watching at this point in the video, you are not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. We do cool shit over here and I'll see you in the next one. Love you guys. Peace! Don't